let's get some wisdom from Proverbs 18. Loners who care only for themselves spit on the common good. Fools care nothing for thoughtful disclosure. All they do is run off at the mouth. When wickedness arrives, shame's not far behind. Contempt for life is contemptible. Many words rush along like rivers in flood, but deep wisdom flows up from artesian springs. It's not right to go easy on the guilty or come down hard on the innocent. The words of a fool start fights. Do him a favor and gag him. I like that. Fools are undone by their big mouths. Their souls are crushed by their words. Listening to gossip is like eating cheap candy. Do you really want junk like that in your belly? Do you? Verse 9. Slack habits and sloppy work are as bad as vandalism. God's name is a place of protection. Good people can run there and be safe. The rich think their wealth protects them. They imagine themselves safe behind it. Pride first, then the crash, but humility is a precursor to honor. Answering before listening is both stupid and rude. A healthy spirit conquers adversity, but what can you do when the spirit is crushed? Wise men and women are always learning, always listening for fresh insights. A gift gets attention, but it buys the attention of eminent people. The first speech in a court case always seems convincing until the cross-examination starts. You may have to draw straws when faced with a tough decision. Do a favor and win a friend forever. Nothing can untie that bond. Words satisfy the mind as much as fruit does the stomach. Good talk is as gratifying as a good harvest. Words kill. Words give life. They're either poison or fruit. You choose. Find a good spouse and you find a good life. Amen to that. And even more, the favor of God. The poor speak in soft supplications. The rich bark out answers. Friends come and friends go, but a true friend sticks by you like family. That is true. What wise words from Proverbs chapter 18. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. You can contact me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. 